I do want to address my question to Chuck. Um, and as the chair of the subcommittee for the preservation of the Second Amendment, please tell us if any of the 26 gun bills filed to date will address parental responsibility um, for scenarios such as occurred last week when a 12-year-old brought a loaded weapon to school and it unfortunately discharged in green tea. Okay. I'm happy to hear from everybody else on this too. But. Anybody else who wants to answer, fine. She's addressed it to Representative Basie. Okay, thank you, Margaret. Um, I am not familiar with the bill uh, that covers that uh, particular topic. Um, I know that uh, at last I looked, there was 22 bills. So I, if you said 26, that that uh, that must be that there's uh, some added. Uh, you know, I, I don't know. That's a that's a tough issue. There's a lot of factors involved in what you uh, claim there. Um, I don't know what the facts are in that case, but uh, it comes down to personal responsibility, and a lot of times uh, some things happen with uh, firearms that uh, that aren't pleasant. But uh, if if I knew the facts in that case, I would speak on it. But I don't. Um, but I believe uh, I believe strongly in the Second Amendment and. Uh, I know that some of the bills that most likely will hear, uh, hear uh, coming forward are probably not going to be a favor for uh, some people in this room, but uh, I know there's going to be a push to remove some of the gun-free zones and, um, and a few others uh, that are uh, not necessarily similar, but uh, I'm out of time. Anybody else on the panel want to address that same question? Speak now. <laughs> I say nobody else. I, I don't know. I don't know of a, if any legislation filed. I would assume that there has been. Um, I would, but I'm not exactly for sure. I, I'm more than happy to have a conversation and, and to look into uh, the legislation that you're referencing and talk about it. I'll make the call. Okay. Uh, so basically, you ask about guns, but the thing is, you can't childproof their whole life. Um, I knew of a child who got into a bottle of vitamins and they overdosed because it had iron in them. You can't put up every butcher knife in your house, uh, every cleaning pine saw in your house. Accidents happen, things happen. So um, I know of a kid that got his fingers cut off because he put them in a lawnmower. So, you know, parents need to be responsible in all aspects of their child's life, including putting seatbelts on. So it's not just guns where children can get hurt or adults get hurt. Things happen. Oh,